guys welcome to today's video and welcome back to my channel i hope you're all really really well thank you so much for joining me on another episode of vlogmas i'm so excited to have you here quite excited for this one um well these next couple <laughs> i know they're a bit late so i apologize for that um but i don't really like doing like gift guides for like children like just like oh, I don't know how to explain it like just to show you um I like to show you what we've purchased for them because it's been like carefully curated and thought about and things like that so yeah I don't really do gift guides in here's a guide here's what I could get them I like to show you what I've actually got them um so I'm sorry it's a bit late but I also like people to use this not just for Christmas, you know, if you've maybe got like a three year old's birthday coming up or you just want to buy a present, it doesn't just have to be for Christmas. So yeah, hopefully you can use that for those. Um, but before we get into it, please can I ask if you haven't already, please do consider subscribing to my channel. It's totally free and takes literally a few seconds of your time just underneath this video you just click subscribe and the bell and thank you so much if you do go on to do that because I'm really plugging away and working hard on trying to get there with my channel so thank you for all your support um, and aside from obviously vlogmas which I'm in the midst of now um, I cover all things about my pregnancy um, motherhood toddlerhood day in the life hauls vintage hauls um, just a bit of everything so yeah if that's your cup of tea then please do consider subscribing so today's video as you can see from the title is um what we have brought out of love for christmas um so i've broken it down into two sections so we've brought him some clothing how oh, i say we let's be honest i'm in me <laughs> Mom, tommy will open this on christmas day and my husband will be like okay uh, and then we've obviously got the toys. So um, we have, my husband obviously, we talked about picking the toys and things like that. I went and picked them up and everything. But yeah, the clothes are more me. So I've separated this into two. So I'm gonna go through the clothing first, literally because it's on top of the bag. And then we'll go through the toys. Um, but yeah. I'm, I don't know am I wrong like I actually feel a bit weird giving him clothes for Christmas but like I've brought him so much nice stuff recently that I didn't just want to shove it in his wardrobe and be like oh there you go so I thought why not add it into the, like the pile and be like there you go Merry Christmas um let me know how you do it as well because Tommy probably doesn't have the level of understanding that some will be from Santa and some would be from Mummy and Daddy. Um, so we're just going full blown Santa. Um, when he's a bit older and he still obviously believes in the big man, um, we will then likely say, well, these ones are from Santa, but Mummy and Daddy got you these ones. And maybe do like different wrapping paper or something. Um, so yeah, he, he just won't understand. And to be honest with you, there's just no point in trying to separate the two because he just won't understand so yeah let me know what you do in the comments because obviously i feel a bit like odd <laughs> that we're just doing santa um but yeah i think when he's older like say for example i don't know like maybe next year he's gonna need a bike with like a proper bike instead of a balanced bike mm. i'd maybe do sorry that's my phone going off I'd maybe do like the bikes from mummy and daddy and then all the little presents are from Santa. Like I ain't letting the big man take credit for the big presents, okay? Um, no. But yeah, let me know what you do. Um, I'd be so interested to know. Um, but yeah, let's go through the clothes because this video is gonna be so long, I can already feel it. Um, I will link all of the presents and all of the clothing in the description box below for you so that you have access to order any of these bits if you wanted to um, I do have some discount codes for the clothing as well and um, so I'll pop them on screen and down in the description box as well for you um, but yeah I won't go into like details on the clothing and um, 
like toy prices because some of them I bought so long ago. But yeah. yeah. It's all down there. So if you want it, just go and have a look. It is all down there for you. Um, I have already done Tommy's links already for this video. So yeah, I'm already ahead of it. Um, so clothing wise, he's got a batch of stuff from the personal mum. Um, I do have a few more bits coming from her, which I may wrap up as well. But I'm not too sure yet. But we, regardless, this is basically the bulk that you're seeing. If not, just check out my Instagram because I'd have shared it on there anyway. Um, so we've got this Life is an Adventure tracksuit there. And the trousers, I got those in age three to four. Um, I have filmed a separate haul um, for the personal mum but it's likely you'll see it after this gift guide because I want the gift guide to go out sooner so yeah if you want like more in-depth details about the clothing then hold out for that haul because it is coming but I wanted to get this out first um, he's got the big apple NYC um, jumper which I love um, I've also got these for Oxley so they can like mix and match. So yeah, really oh my, my gingerbread man's having a having a party. Um and then I've got the brown one there for him. Again in age three to four. Um I can't wait to see the boys like mix and match in that like next year. They're gonna be so cute in all their outfits. But yes. Um, before I head on to like the next batch of clothes, I do have a discount code for the personal mum. It is Hodgson's15, which will save you 15% on your order. Um, you can use that on top of like ex mostly existing offers. Um, so like if the beanies, for example, are reduced from like 12 to 10, you get another 15% off the 10. So it's definitely worth it. Um, and then um, again, you will see this in a separate haul coming after these gift guides but I thought I would just show you so we've got a these are all from um, Taylor Made to You again I have a discount code um, which I will pop on screen now it is Hodgson's 10 um, so yeah do head on over and save yourself a bit of money so we've got Don't Kill My Vibe which I just love this I love the colour I love the design I love the stitching just I just love it all to be honest um, we have Chase Your Dreams, which I love. I love this like sagey colour. Um, then we have some track suits. So we've got the um, freshly baked croissant one there. Um, Oxley has this to match in his pile as well. So cannot wait for that. I love. I just love the idea of them in matching outfits. It just makes me so happy. Um, We've got the National Park one, which is this lovely beige. Um, obviously has matching trousers. I'm not gonna show you the trousers on each one because they're just trousers. <laughs> We've got the Amsterdam on the sage green. There, love that. That comes as a tracksuit as well. So that's there, got it there. Got that one, I'll just pop that down, and then we've got the beige one again, which is the Beverly Hills one, which I cannot wait to match with um, his Nikes with the green tick that he's already got. So, yeah, a little bit obsessed with that one. God, this weather is awful literally, terrible. Um, so yeah, they're all his like tracksuits. I've been finding a couple of these on Vintage for Oxley as well. Like Oxley's got on um, the matching Amsterdam one that I got on there. And I think I said it in my Vintage haul that because obviously Oxley's not going to be in them for as long as Tommy is and obviously it's likely Oxley's aren't going to be reborn. Um, that getting it on Vintage is actually quite nice because then you're not paying complete full price. <laughs> um, so yeah, love that. Do keep an eye on Vinted for these kinds of bits though, because yeah, they definitely come about. Um, and then he's got a couple of loungewear sets that 
Oxley hand matching as well, but I will show you those in Oxley's gift guide. So we've got the ribbed loungewear with his um, initials there. These do sometimes come on offer for like £10, um, like I think she calls them like the loungewear offer. Um, so yeah, do keep an eye out for those, but obviously you've got my discount code to use in the meantime. We've got this beige one with the name, which I just love. Man. We've got a couple of knitwear tops. Um, so Tommy has got a jumper with his name on, which I'm just obsessed with. Again, more detail will be gone into in the big haul for this. Um, so yeah, do keep your eye out for that. I obviously just don't want to bore you twice. Um, I wanted to get this gift guide out, so yeah. Um, and then we've got Cozy Club. Uh, and yeah, so I just love it. I cannot wait to see him in all of these. Um, so yeah, that's all of the clothing for Tommy, um, which we will wrap up for him. Um, now let's get into the toys. Oh, actually, oh no, there's one more bit. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm giving them to him or my mum and dad are. They're yet to let me know. But basically, I had some birthday money to spend for Tommy on some trainers. Long story short, any trainers we've wanted have gone out of stock <laughs> or sold out or whatever. And I love, I just really want him to have Hunter Willies. I know they're expensive, but because his middle name is Hunter, I've always wanted him to have some. Um, so I went into the shop, into shoe, to have a look, see what they had. They had an offer on where you, if you buy two shoes, you got £10 off. And um, yeah, so I got the Hunters, which oh, I need to go and change the size. Um, but then they had these. I did think about getting him some Converse. But we, me and my mum decided on these in the end. So he's actually got a pair of gazelles, which are just so nice. Um, so I might be giving them to the, him, these to him. Oh, my mum and dad might be. But yeah, we've got him those. So I got some money off them. So yeah, I used his birthday money for the hunters. And then these for, um, for Christmas. So yeah, love, love, love. But yeah, let's get into the toys. Hi guys, future me here. <laughs> Literally, it's it's night time. Um, but I realised whilst Oxy was napping on me earlier and I was like, oh, I need to edit this video, um, that I'd totally forgotten about um, a bunch of clothes that I'm going to also put in um, Tommy's Christmas pile that I bought actually a little while ago. But... Uh, yeah, so I'm just going to pop this in before I get to showing you the videos. Um, it's only four things. Yeah, it's only four things. Um, and as you can tell, a bit of a theme. But yeah, I literally I'm just running the boys' bath, so <laughs> I thought I'll quickly show you this. Um, so I got the bluey, like, postage stamp top. Um, a lot of people are saying these are, like, too Christmassy and wintery, but I don't think it is. So, yeah got that in three to four so that is these are a little bit more expensive like jerseys <clears throat> because they're character um so these are actually um 10.99 obviously because of the character and then i've got the plain um gray one with the family there um, I've got this one in three to four as well. This one's eleven ninety nine. Not really sure why. Um, but yeah, love this, and he just loves bluey, so I think he's gonna love like, actually wearing bluey because um, he doesn't have anything bluey at the moment. Can I just say though, like feeling this? I mean, I know we all love a bit of Zara, but can I just say the quality of um, V Plus Me like stock is so much better. And Zara, like I'm feeling them, and I'm like, mm. V plus me, yes. 
Um, and then the jumpers I've actually got in four to five. So the top in four to five I thought looked really, really big. Um, and obviously tops are a bit cheaper. Um, but I thought, obviously I'm going to keep them for Oxley anyway, but with the jumpers, when you actually measure them up next to each other, there's not a lot in it. There's literally like that at the bottom and maybe like that on the side, which is probably quite a lot, but he's got a lot of three to four tops anyway. So I figured even if they're just a bit oversized, like they'll be fine. Um, so I picked up this blurry one. Again, a lot of people say, oh, it's too Christmassy because it's got snowflakes on. Um, but again, I just don't think it is. I think this will be really nice to wear like the beginning of 2024 and then it will probably still fit towards the end so we can whack it back out. So yeah, I'm so excited about Tommy's like new wardrobe phase. Like literally, it's giving me life. Um, and on the back, it says, let's take this to the max. Bluey. Um, so yeah, love, love, love. Um, yep, so that can go in his little pile. And then I just couldn't leave this tracksuit behind. Again, I measured up the three to four and it just looked really small. So I got to the four to five. And I just love the color of it. Comes with trackies. Um, these will probably be a bit long and a bit big for him, but I thought I could probably like maybe mix these with some like leggings and stuff before these fit him. It's a shame actually, I'd rather they done this as a separate, like they usually do, because you can get matching joggers to this. So I'd actually liked to have got this in a four to five, and these in a three to four, um, which would probably make it harder to resell, but we move. But yeah, I think he's gonna be so excited for these blue bits. So yeah, love that. And obviously, hopefully Oxley likes bluey, because <laughs> He'll be getting somewhere out of these two. Um, but yeah, that's tracksuits the same price as their normal tracksuits, so you don't sort of get done for the character. And then the brown one is $16.99, so a little bit more expensive. Um, so yeah, I just wanted to quickly come on and film that, and I'll insert this between the clothes that I show you for Tommy and then the toys. So yeah, anyways, enjoy the toy part of the video. <laughs> so I've just got a big bag of it here so I'm just literally going to get it out show you put it down in front of me and then tidy it up after um so in no order um I picked him up this little town farm activity box so it's got like magnets and stuff I thought this was really really cool um for him to like have a little chalkboard and like the magnets and I love so you can close it up and then like carry it around so we can take it out with our sort of people's houses so yeah, love that. Um, that was an Audi, but quite a while ago, so I don't know if it's still there. Um, he's got the Thomas and Friends library. Um, so it has six stories in, um, and I got this from TK Maxx for six ninety nine quite a little while ago. So yeah, he loves Thomas, so that was a win. Um, we've got him the Orchard Toys Farmyards Heads and Tails game because I think he'll really really um, like putting these together um, and it's obviously quite a good learning sort of hand to have um, to be like oh that's a cow and a chicken and stuff so yeah these are about seven pound in Smith so yeah definitely looking forward to playing that with him um, from the same brand I actually got the match and spell um, game I actually got this from like a mum's market for like £1.50 um, but like it's literally hardly been used. Still got all the instructions in and everything so yeah. Definitely go and check out like local mum markets because they're so good. Um, I think when we start getting rid of more I'll be doing the same. So yeah, I've got that. Um, I've got him, he loves having frothy coffee which is just frothed warm milk um so i actually got him the baby chino cup so that he can have his little frothy coffee in there um i think he can have the the marshmallows i think he can i have to check 
Yep, no, he can. Um, so yeah, got him that, which was £8.50 from Matalan. Sorry, I'm just popping it all up behind me. Um, a lot of it after. This is a lot of bluey, so um, I'm trying to keep all the bluey stuff together. Um, Adam got him this like builder boat set. Um, I can't remember where he got it from, you know. But it's a bath time puzzle complete with sea life friends, so he can have that in the bath, and he loves toys in the bath, so yeah, I think that's really good. And it comes with a little like sticky bit, so he can stick that up. Um, oh, yep, yeah. a couple of other presents here. As you can see, he doesn't really have like big present, like, he doesn't have like the big present. Like one year it would have been his kitchen and things like that. So yeah, it's just lots of nice presents, I think. Um, he loves like these mess-free mats. Um, he's had a few over the years, but I thought he would get him a new one and I love this one. Um, so a lot of them are like, you just put the water and the picture's already there. Whereas this one he can do himself um, and you can fold it up there and take it out with you and put pens in it and stuff so yeah I thought that'd be good again something to take round when we go to like my in-laws or we go to my mum and dad's um so this is Crayola from Smith's and it's 17 99 I think I know I said I wasn't gonna tell you prices but there we go um and then when Tommy sees my camera out for vlogging he's obsessed with my camera like he picks it up and he's like oh mummy look let's film um, and take a picture um, so we decided to get him his own um, so it's the VTech Kiddie Zoom Duo um, and it does actually take pictures and videos um, and has like little effects on it and it does have a couple of games so I think this was actually really reasonable it was a little bit more on the expensive side granted but it was 49.99 but I just think like he's gonna love this because he's so obsessed with my camera I think he's just going to be like, oh, um, so yeah, it's obviously quite durable, so hopefully he's not going to break it. Famous last words. Although, what a waste of packaging, like, this is all empty down here, what a waste. Um, so yeah, I think he'll, he'll love this. This will hopefully be one of his favourites. Um, so yeah, love that. Um, and then the rest is all bluey. So, I got him this bluey memory game from Tesco's, it's five pounds. Um, and it's still in there right now. So I got him that. I think, again, I just thought that'd be really good for like learning and things like that. Um, so he's got that. Um, in Frost's, when we went recently, they had, they obviously have like a big book section and they had this um, magnet book. So you have the story oh, like there, and you can put the magnets on each page. Um, he does love a sticker book, but he does get quite frustrated with them sometimes. Um, so I thought the magnets might be a good thing to try because he can just stick them on, take them off, and you know, change it as and as when he pleases. So yeah, I thought that was a really good idea. This was eight ninety nine. They have like Peppa Pig one. I believe they had like spot the dog he had another one as well i can't remember but they do um they do have quite a few so yeah just pop in like magnet books um online i'm sure you'll be able to get them from like amazon or something um these next four bits were from the audi event so i have linked them down below but they're obviously not from audi um and may not be the same prices but yeah Oh, I forgot to tag Bob Bilby. Um, so if you watch Bluey, he's got a Bob Bilby puppet. So yeah, I got that for him. Um, they need to do a unicorn puppet in my opinion, but we move because they don't. Um, and then we got Bluey's playground there. So he already has the Bluey house, um, the car and the rubbish bin at the moment. So these are just great little add-on bits. So he's got Bluey's Playground. Um, sorry, I'm 
I'm just looking where to put these. Uh, family backyard barbecue, which has the barbecue, obviously, and a picnic blanket, and then bandit. And then we have a bingo's ice cream cart. Um, so I love in each of them, like obviously we've already got these characters because Tommy does have the um, character carry case that he got from my in-laws. Um, so it's nice just to add a couple more in, even if they're the same, but they're slightly different. So like obviously Bingo's got ice cream on. Um, so yeah, it's just nice to add a few more characters in. And then he's got, I got this ages ago when... Um, Sainsbury's actually had an event on with like their toy event so I got the ultimate beach cabin playset. Ah. yes I need to tap this so it's the this one so it's another house um, yeah he's got the beach cabin playset um, so it's got the big beach cabin, the pool, a jet ski and other stuff there. So this was actually £60 reduced to 30 So like, how could you not? Um, so yeah, that's everything for Tommy. Um, so yeah, he's got clothes, he's got toys. I think he's got enough. I don't know, as a mum you always just look and I think, oh god, do they have enough? Like... Oh, and he's gonna get so much from other people. Like I'm already panicking where I'm gonna put all of this, but I think that's a new year's job to like sort out everything. Um, so, yeah, Ooh, scary. Um, but yeah, that's everything we've got him. I'm so sorry about the weather changing here. <laughs> and the lights coming in. But yeah, that's everything we've got him. I think he's got a really nice selection. He's got some bluey. I was conscious I didn't want it to be too bluey, but obviously he loves bluey. So we've got him a few bits. Um, so yeah, hopefully he'll love it. And we've done okay. Let me know what you think in the comments. Have we got enough? Have we got too much? Actually, I'm probably opening myself up for a realm of opinions there, but... Um, what have you got your like little ones or three-year-olds i'd love to know so yeah do share um but yeah i'm gonna go and literally film oxley's which is there uh put tommy's away and i've got to film another little haul as well so yeah i'm gonna go um i hope you found this useful um and i hope you maybe go and pick up a couple of these bits let me know if you do let me know if you enjoyed the video um and do could do please consider subscribing. I look forward to hearing what you've got your little ones. And yeah, thank you so much for watching and joining me today and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys.